fitting the pigeons downtown Tucson. She has a hurt leg, so she doesn't walk too much. But try to feed him as much as I can every day. Okay. You feed them every day? Every day. Oh, that is so cute. Isaiah, look at this. Just keep holding up, honey. They'll come to you. Isn't that awesome? They just came to you. Yep. Just keep holding it up, honey. They'll come to you. <laughs> They're all friendly. <laughs> that is incredible. Oh, look at that. No, I usually have them all over my head every day. So you're here like every day you feed them and... Well, I got stranded here about three months ago, so I've been homeless ever since. So not much else to do other than come and feed the pigeons and trying to get home. So come and sit, feed the pigeons and there's Where an old guy. From? Kansas. Kansas? Yep. And oh. there's an old guy that lives here at the library so I bring him food every day and bring the pigeons every day and feed them and trying so to get trying home. So you're trying to get back to Kansas? Trying to get home. Oh dear. How much does it cost to get back to Kansas from here? Um, $218. But they won't let me on the bus because I don't have any ID. What happened to your ID? Uh, somebody That's stole my purse when I got here. That's how I got stranded. Did you report it to the, the police and, and stuff? Yep, reported it, everything. And But you have to have ID to get ID. And so you have to have a social security card, but they want birth certificate and stuff. And so if I spend my money to buy a birth certificate, then I don't have enough money to get home. So it's just a big circle. But you know what? I don't think I've ever been happier than when I've been here. You got family back in Kansas? Uh, my kids go to college at KU. Oh, did you contact them to see if they can get your stuff here? Yeah, also? yep, they're coming in two weeks to get me. Oh, that's so awesome. Yep. Wow. But they were on Christmas vacation and didn't have enough time to come out and get me. And the weather was bad, so I would rather they didn't drive, so but it's okay. I met a lot of really nice people since I've been here. Well, I'm glad. Oh, well, it was nice meeting you. What's your name? I'm Veronica. Veronica, I'm Harriet. Nice to meet you, Harriet. Nice, nice to meet you, too. too. Your daughter's beautiful. Thank you. We decided to come downtown today. Just take time out after the storm. No, just hold your hand out. Take the bread. Take the bread and hold your hand out. I'll put them on you. I'll put them on you. But don't they have sharp claws? If they don't hurt you. They don't hurt you. <laughs> you know what? Because we don't hurt them. As long as we're nice to them. Oh, can you catch one? Like, you just holding? You don't want to catch them because they have disease, but oh. you just want to feed them and and hang out with them. Here you go. Hey, 